Warning, this video is not for the faint of heart. Tonight, we'll rediscover the scariest theme park moments ranked by you. Beginning with Tree Monster, Colossus. Colossus is a large and intimidating wooden roller coaster in Hyde Park. This is Europe's fastest and tallest wooden roller coaster, but the ride has more terrifying aspects. In 2019, the ride reopened after a refurbishment with the addition of a huge tree monster that increases the scare factor of the ride. The monster looks very realistic, as it was constructed with great attention to detail. A chilling sight to witness indeed. To further enhance the overall ride experience, special effects such as lighting, fire, and a roaring soundtrack were also included. Being eaten by a huge tree makes this experience very intense and scary from start to finish. Hell, Mr. Toad's Wild Ride. We cannot leave out Mr. Toad's Wild Ride. Dark rides traditionally feature a lot of sharp turns and fast transitions between scenes, so it was an easy adaptation to do. This ride features a few particularly scary scenes. As you flee the police towards London, you find yourself reeling through a TNT factory, which sets off a chain of explosions that brings down a brick wall. But the creepiest thing of all, of course, is that after your day in court and being found guilty of many crimes, you drive headfirst into a train and descend into hell. The hell room of this ride is heated and features the judge now as the devil, a handful of cackling demons, and a smoking dragon. Pretty terrifying, to be honest. Monster Hunter The Real Monster Hunter is one of the most loved franchises in Japan, and Universal and Capcom came together to create a special Monster Hunter-inspired event at Universal Studios Japan. The attraction had an impressive animatronic of Zinogre, who, with the help of sounds and effects, could be seen completely electrified. The best part of this attraction was that, with the help of vibrating effects and sounds installed in the attraction, guests could physically feel the sensation of being struck by lightning. The monster is huge and imposing, and the whole experience was very scary. Dinosaur Fight – Jurassic World The Ride Universal Studios Hollywood closed the Jurassic Park ride back in 2018, so it could be replaced with a new Jurassic World theme. As a result, there were several changes made on this ride, like the addition of this new Indominus animatronic that is busting out of the wall and biting at guests. But while this animatronic is pretty scary, there are more impressive and terrifying additions. In the end, a big change was made when the T-Rex used to attack guests. Now, a full-sized Indominus animatronic is seen. The animatronic is seeking her rival, the T-Rex, and both dinosaurs are seen battling their claim to be the most terrifying predator in the area. This final battle scene is mind-blowing, but very terrifying and imposing. Before we continue, tell us what is the most terrifying experience you have had at a theme park in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe. Spook Slot, Eftling. We had to add Spook Slot to this list. This attraction was full of scary and creepy animatronics and moments. From the several spooky animatronics in the queue to the effects, the spookiness of this attraction was set even before the show began. We can't even choose the creepiest part. It might be this corpse hanging from a bell string, the three judges appearing at the top, a corpse emerging from her grave, or the witch burning. Spook Slot was full of scary moments. Sadly, Spook Slot closed to make way for a new frightening attraction, so we'll see if this recent refurbishment will make it even more terrifying. Devil's Snare, Hagrid's Magical Creatures Motorbike Adventure. This is one of the best attractions at Universal Studios Florida. It features many fantastic animatronics and takes guests to the Forbidden Forest, where they come face to face with many of these magical creatures. But of course, venturing into the Forbidden Forest is not without its scary scenes. One of these scenes takes us into the darkest part of the Forbidden Forest, where we encounter a centaur before stepping on the tentacles of the Devil's Snare. The scene is dark and very creepy. Hagrid encourages us to say Lumos Solem and free ourselves from the tentacles, and we are able to do this. But that makes the motorbike have a free fall of 17 feet without warning. This part of the ride is very fun, but also pretty scary. Jin, Fata Morgana. Fata Morgana is one of Efling's first and most ambitious dark rides. Some of the scenes can be creepy and terrifying, which is the case with the giant Jin. The Jinn is a gigantic, fearsome-looking creature who acts as the guardian of the treasure. 
It is one of the greatest figures in the park, and probably the most frightening element of the ride. When the curtains of the treasury open, the djinn towering over the boat grunts, shakes his head, and sets the whole treasury in motion with its pillars and draperies. Perhaps the creepiest part is that we escape the giant by passing between his legs, and entering the next scene. Earthquake. Tram Tour. One of the most iconic attractions in Universal Studios Hollywood is the Tram Tour. It currently takes guests through more than 20 attractions and areas, where they can see where movies are made. One of these attractions is Earthquake, the big one. The tram takes us into Stage 5, where we see a seemingly active set, and all seems quiet. But suddenly the ground starts shaking, and the lights begin to flicker. The ceiling cracks and we see a street and a huge trailer carrying a liquid gas tank coming at us. We see fire, sparks, water, and a train crash. This attraction simulates a large earthquake, rated at 8.3 on the Richter scale, and only lasts about 15 seconds. But those few seconds can be terrifying, especially if this is your first time at the attraction. Indominus Chase, Jurassic World Adventure. If you think that last scene is scary, wait till you see this one. Jurassic World Adventure opened in 2012 at Universal Studios Beijing. In this ride, guests board an atlas for a journey through Isla Nublar, where they encounter many life-sized dinosaurs. But one of the most impressive and terrifying scenes is when a full-sized Indominus Rex actually chases the cars. The vehicle is traveling along the track when it runs into the dinosaur. The escaped Indominus chases the ride vehicle for 10 whole seconds. Then, while the car moves backward along the track, she just keeps gaining on it, never relenting. This scene might be impressive, but it is equally, if not more, terrifying. Godzilla. Godzilla Interception. Another terrifying monster that eats riders. Godzilla Interception is a ride located at the Mijimijin no Mori Amusement Park. In this attraction, guests roleplay as researchers, using pulleys to enter Godzilla through his mouth. While inside the beasts, visitors will attempt missions, including a shooting game trying to destroy Godzilla's cells. This Godzilla statue is huge, has thousands of teeth, and when guests pass through the beast's throat, the figure lights up bright purple. This attraction sounds fantastic, but the fact that Godzilla eats you is terrifying. Bruce Attack, Jaws. One of the most missed rides in the history of Universal Studios is Jaws the Ride. Thankfully, it still exists in Universal Studios Japan, where we can still enjoy Bruce's constant attacks. The ride is set on Amity Island, and takes guests to tour the sites where the attacks occurred. But apparently, Bruce is not gone, so he attacks the tour boats. Each attack is more terrifying than the previous one, but the most frightening part is when the shark emerges right next to the tour boat, but accidentally bites down on a submerged power cable from the barge and electrocutes itself. Then he re-emerges, wholly burnt, to attack for the last time. But the skipper shoots at it with a grenade launcher. Imhotep, Revenge of the Mummy. When the Mummy ride opened in 2004, it was promoted by Universal as a psychological thrill ride, thanks to the many different phobias that it touches upon, whether the fears are centered on spiders, beetles, darkness, speed, or corpses. So it was determined that the ride would be scary from the beginning. There are many creepy elements in the ride, but the most terrifying of them all is Imhotep. Imhotep appears several times throughout the ride, but nothing compares to the first Imhotep animatronic we see. The animatronic is creepy, very close, giving us a huge jump scare by literally jumping out of a coffin. And to top it off, it kills Reggie, a crew member. When the massive stone coffin next to Reggie bursts open, and the half-decayed Imhotep jumps out, you will definitely be scared. Dementors, Harry Potter and the Forbidden Journey. Harry Potter and the Forbidden Journey is a marvel. It incorporates dark ride elements, motion simulator movements, projections, and animatronics, and uses a system that creates the feeling that guests are flying. But it is not without its scary scenes. The scariest scene by far is the one where dozens of Dementors appear. In this scene, animatronic Dementors mounted on moving arms emerge from the darkness. Suddenly, one specific Dementor descends and attempts to suck out the rider's souls. Originally, this sequence was supposed to feature many more Dementors coming after guests, but the scene was deemed too frightening, and it was limited to one Dementor. But that one Dementor is definitely scary enough. Sea Monster, E. Kosari. The E. Kosari Dark Ride in Gardaland is an iconic ride where guests embark on a journey underground, while they are chased by the ghosts of the Corsairs. They come across dueling pirates and sunken shipwrecks along this journey, complete with the occasional sea monster. This ride has many creepy scenes, but the sea monster is the most terrifying. Amidst flashing red and green lights, he rises out of the water. The monster ascends to reveal his humanoid face, 
His eyes flash terrifyingly, creating a terrifying sight. The sea monster can move his face and jaw up and down, much like he would if he were able to grab and eat you. His eyeballs are also completely white without any pupils, adding to the scary sight. Spider and Shark Hollywood Tour Hollywood Tour at Fantasia Land was a water ride that took guests on a ride through various scenes from iconic Hollywood films. The ride was exciting and pretty cool, but it wasn't without its terrifying moments. The first of them being a cave where the boat sank in water from a few meters, and suddenly a shark emerged from the water and attacked the boat. And if this wasn't enough, another shark attacked the boat from the opposite direction. Sometimes the second shark might not attack, but always lurked in the background, inducing panic and fear. But the terror didn't end there, because in the next scene, the movie Tarantula was represented very vividly. A huge spider awaited guests who passed through its legs so closely that you could even be able to feel its furry legs. Hollywood Tour was an undoubtedly scary ride through the world of film and cinema, and we are sad to report that it is now closed and does not look like it's coming back. If you need more scary scenes at theme parks, you need to check out this video, covering the scariest dark ride scenes at Disney parks.